Hi friends, the next live session that we would conduct will be on the 1st of September, that is the coming Sunday from 10 a.m. to 12 in the noon during a regular live session hours. And this live session is open to everyone. So we'll broadcast it on YouTube. I'll also provide you a link to the YouTube live session itself in the description section and also in the comment section below this video. So this time we wanted to cover a topic wherein we see lot of lot of folks who want to transition to machine learning roles get stuck at. We have seen thousands of students who have put in good amount of effort, who have learned all the concepts. We have also learned programming, Python, tons of libraries, tons of machine learning algorithms, deep learning libraries, deep learning algorithms, but who fail when it comes to transitioning to machine learning roles. One of the most common mistakes that we encounter, both our students and in general folks who are transitioning to machine learning roles commit is how to prepare your resume and your profile for machine learning and data science roles. So you've done all of the heavy lifting, you've done a lot of effort, you've, you've put in a lot of effort, but your resume and profile that you build and share with potential recruiters needs to be at a certain standard for the recruiter or the hiring manager to take you seriously. So what we'll do again, we are conducting a two hour live session primarily to focus on a wide spectrum of candidates. You could have a candidate who is a third year BTEC student who is apply who is applying for an internship or somebody who is a, who is just finished his undergraduate studies or graduate studies who is a fresher. We would also focus on how to prepare your profile and resume for folks who have zero to two years experience, two to five years experience, five to ten year experience and ten plus years of experience. And again, this session is, is, a, is a summary of all the learnings that we have had along with our, along with our students, wherein we have, we have helped thousands of students learn and transition to machine learning roles. Right? So what we're trying to do is we're trying to take the summary of all of our learnings and share it with all of you so that when you apply for machine learning roles, your profile and your portfolio, whether it is your blogs that you write, whether the code that you share on GitHub, whether it's the projects that you showcase, how they should be based on your expertise, both in terms of years of experience, your background, for example, from which domain or from which sub area of computer science are you coming from, or even the business or industry that you have prior experience in. So we'll try to spend a complete two hours trying to address many, many questions on the front of how to build your profile so that your resume will be taken seriously by recruiters and hiring managers, right? Very, very important because we've seen tons of people who have put in six months, 12 months of effort learning machine learning, but failing at the most important step, which is showcasing your skills and your profile to potential recruiters and hiring managers, right? So in, any questions that you want us to address as part of this session, please put your comments in the, in the comment section below this video. We'll try to answer as many as possible in the live session. Additionally, during the live session itself, we'll have blocks of time where we will open up the discussion for everyone, where we'll try to answer questions from the live chat window. So we'll try to cover some of the core core, uh, core concepts and core ideas that we wanted to cover, but we'll also open up the platform for everyone to ask their question and we'll try to answer as many questions as possible. But we'll limit the discussion mostly towards transitioning to machine learning roles, especially in the context of building your profile and your resume so that your resume and profile is taken seriously by recruiters and hiring managers. So hope to see you all. It's, it's, it's an exciting summary of ideas and thoughts that we have on this topic that we wanted to share with you. See you all and it's open to everyone, not just our registered students, because we hope this will benefit everyone who is learning machine learning and taking the transition to machine learning jobs seriously.